Hi everyone, this is Gleeza made with Glee. Welcome to my kitchen. I am taking part of a collaboration. Well, actually, it's two collaborations. I'm late on one, but I'm doing two in one.、Uh, this is called Baking Spirits Bride and Thrifted Cookie Jar、uh, collaboration hosted by Secondhand Tracy Ann. Last week, Tracy did the、um, Baking Spirits Bright, which I couldn't do because I had house guests. So I'm going to give you a tour of my kitchen and of my thrifted cookie jars. So, starting off, I have my Calories Don't Count at Christmas cross stitch. I made that in 2017, made that into a standing flat fold, and it is hiding some household essentials on my kitchen counter. Behind that, I have my security camera, my router, and my emergency weather radio. That's the stuff that's hidden behind there, it's always there, you know, things you need in the house. And this is my cookie jar that I thrifted this year the snowman with the pie. And the penguin, I got that from Goodwill for five dollars. I want to say back in September. And、uh, the gnome is a cookie jar I've had another maybe two or three years now. I got him from Amazon. And there is my joy sign leading out to my joy sign, my joy rug leading out of my kitchen to the patio. And there you have my curtain with a garland that I made from one of those kitty. Gingerbread man kits, yes, it's like actually ornaments for kids. I made it and then I made the peppermint candy myself and made a garland to hang up over my door. So that is part of my kitchen decor because it's this is like right next to my kitchen and it leads out into the patio. So now back to the kitchen after you've、um, Past the area, the first area. This is my window that looks out, and here, this is right over the sink. I have the other valance that I made, and my collection of gnomes, along with an O、oh、snap gingerbread sign. I love that, it's so cute. And this、uh, whimsical tree that I made is from last year when I did like my Whoville theme,、um, and that's sitting in my gnome cart. Then I have the cookie wreath from the International Wreath Challenge. I keep switching. Which door the wreaths are on. But now the wreaths on that door. And here is my decor for my coffee station, beverage station, all the teas, the cookie jars. And here is another thrifted cookie jar. This one is Santa Claus. And my aunt actually thrifted this and gave it to me、um, a year or two years ago. She gave me two of them. I'll show you the second one in a second. The gnome I got last year. Valentine's Day,、um, and that's pretty much I've shared with you how I decorated my coffee station. Above the microwave, I always have that boxwood wreath, and I just switch out whatever's hanging on it. Right now, I just have a Dollar Tree ornament. And there is my candy cane wreath made from the dollar store frame, some ribbons, and Stuff around, and then here on my kitchen counter, I have my usable goods. You know, so I have a big banana harvest that just happened, so that's why you see bananas and stuff there. There's a gingerbread I made, a gingerbread man I made from my using my cry cut. I have this thrifted snowman also from my aunt, and that was given to me about two years. She gave me two of them at the same time when she was downsizing, but both of them were thrifted by her. And then the Baking Spirits Bright sign, the,、um, I made that also on my c r i c k e t And then, yes, I just realized I had stuff on my stove, so I took it down. <laughs> so, this, guys, is how my kitchen looks. I love all my little gnomes and my O、oh、snaps. Sign, I think it's the cutest thing ever with the broken gingerbread, and、um, you know, that's it. This is my kitchen, this is what it looks like. It's usually a lot messier, but currently, I'm not cooking because today is Friday, I don't cook on Fridays. And yes, we have cookies in the can because it's the holiday season and they're on sale, so we have cookies. And in my Santa、um, cookie jar, I actually have. Decaf teas and coffees because when my house guests came, they drink decaf. 
so that's where I stored the decaf and then you know we have all of our regular stuff so yes see I moved the foil paper I was cleaning and I totally forgot so this is how everything looks baking's for its bright like I said that's a sign I made on my cry cut the snowman cookie jar again thrifted by my aunt for me I had that little gingerbread pick usually you could stick a sign like I said that one came from I made that also using my cry cut and then I have uh, also on my kitchen counter my produce and things that we use and that uh, green bananas I have like a 60 pound harvest of green bananas so some are inside and some are still hanging outside and then let me show you my fridge and everything else in in this kitchen um, you'll probably notice I have a lot of fridge magnets everyone who goes somewhere um, my family and my friends they bring me back a magnet and I appreciate that so very much because regardless of where they are in the world they're thinking of me to pick up a little magnet so of course I'm gonna display it on the fridge so one half of the fridge has places that I did not go and you know the places that my friends and family went and the other side of the fridge has places where I've been to and you know where my husband has been to so those are the two sides of my fridge and all of the different magnets I just absolutely love them I like I like having a memory of where we've traveled to and where we've been and I appreciate when my family members go somewhere and bring me back a magnet because like I said regardless of where they are in the world they think enough about me to get me one of those so this is my kitchen I hope you guys like my baking spirits bright tour I hope you like my thrifted cookie jars I will be linking our hostess secondhand Tracy and her uh, a channel below in the description box as well as the playlist so that you can see all of the thrifted cookie jars and I'll also link in there the baking spirits bright collaboration from last week so you can see how others have also decorated their kitchens for the holiday so this is mine I hope you like it please hit that like button and that subscribe button and I will see you in another video soon have a wonderful day I hope Mrs. Claus approves. Thanks, Tracy Ann. Bye, everyone. Happy holidays.